Animals that look similar. Alpaca and llama. Llamas and alpacas are both native to the Andes region of South America. They are closely related to camels. However, there are a few key differences between the two animals. Llamas are larger and taller than alpacas, with longer faces and ears. Alpacas are smaller and more compact, with shorter faces and rounder ears. Alpacas have a fur which is softer and more luxurious than the fur of llamas. Crocodile and Alligator Crocodiles and alligators are both large reptiles that belong to the order Crocodilia. They are closely related, but there are a few key differences between the two. Crocodiles are found in many parts of the world, including Africa, Asia, the Americas and Australia. Alligators are native to the United States, specifically the southeastern states such as Florida and Louisiana. Crocodiles are generally lighter in color than alligators. With a pale green or yellowish skin, alligators have a darker, almost black skin. When an alligator closes its mouth, its lower teeth are not visible. In contrast, the lower teeth of a crocodile are visible even when its mouth is closed. Leopard, Cheetah and Jaguar Leopards, jaguars and cheetahs are all big cats, but they belong to a different species. Leopards and jaguars are both members of the Panthera genus, while cheetahs belong to their own separate genus, Asinonyx. Leopards are found in Africa and parts of Asia. Their coat is typically yellow, with black spots arranged in rosettes. Leopards are excellent climbers and able to drag prey up trees. Jaguars are found in the Americas, primarily in the rainforests of South and Central America. Jaguars are the largest cat in the Americas and third largest cat in the world. Their coat is typically yellow, with black spots arranged in a circular pattern. Cheetahs are found in Africa and parts of Asia. Their coat is short and typically tan with a black spot and a distinctive tear stripe running from the corner of the eye to the mouth. Cheetahs are known for their incredible speed and agility and able to reach speeds up to 75 miles per hour. Sheep and Goat Sheep and goats can be difficult to distinguish at first glance, as they are both members of the Bovidae family and have many similar physical characteristics. However, there are a few key differences that can help you tell them apart. One of the most noticeable differences is the shape of their horns. Sheep typically have curved or spiral horns, while goats have straight or slightly curved horns that are more angled. Goats also tend to have beards, while sheep do not. Another way to tell the difference is by looking at the shape of their ears. Goats have long, pointed ears, while sheep have shorter, rounder ears. Rabbit and Hare Rabbits and hares are both mammals in the Leporidae family which also includes picas. However, there are some differences between the two species. One of the main differences is that hares are generally larger than rabbits. Hares also have longer ears and legs, and they are generally more agile and fast running than rabbits. In addition, hares are born with fur and are able to see and move around shortly after birth while rabbits are born blind and hairless and are more dependent on their mothers for care. Another difference is that hares tend to live in open areas and have solitary lifestyles, while rabbits are more social and live in burrows or nests. Butterfly and Moth
Moths and butterflies are both insects in the Lepidoptera order, which means they have wings covered in scales. However, there are several differences between moths and butterflies. One of the most noticeable differences is in their appearance. Butterflies are often brightly colored and have thin, long antennae that are club-shaped at the end. Moths, on the other hand, are often duller in color and have thicker, feathery antennae. Another difference between moths and butterflies is their behavior. Butterflies are diurnal, which means they are active during the day and rest at night. Moths, on the other hand, are nocturnal, meaning they are active at night and rest during the day. Puffin and Penguin Puffins and penguins are both seabirds, but they are not closely related. Puffins are native to the North Atlantic Ocean, while penguins are native to the Southern Hemisphere. Puffins are small, stocky birds, with brightly colored beaks and feet. They have a distinctive appearance, with a black head and back, white underparts and a bright orange or red beak. Penguins are larger more streamlined birds with black and white coloring. They are adapted to life in the water and are excellent swimmers. Hedgehog and Porcupine Hedgehogs and porcupines are two different animals that are often mistaken for one another because they both have spines or quills on their bodies. However, there are some notable differences between the two. Hedgehogs are covered in short, sharp spines, while porcupines have longer, thicker quills that are loosely attached to their skin and can be easily projected when the animal is threatened. Hedgehogs are also known for their ability to curl up into a ball, with their spines sticking out in all directions, to defend themselves from predators. Porcupines, on the other hand, do not have this ability and rely on their quills to deter predators. Duck and Goose Goose and duck are birds that belong to the family Anatidae. They are similar in many ways, but there are some key differences between them. One of the main differences between geese and ducks is their size. Geese are generally larger than ducks, with longer necks and legs. They can also be distinguished by their calls. Geese honk, while ducks quack. Another difference is the shape of their bills. Goose bills are longer and more pointed than duck bills, which are shorter and more rounded. Fox, Wolf and Jackal Wolf, fox and jackal are all carnivorous mammals that belong to the Canidae family. They are closely related and share many physical and behavioral characters. However, they do have some differences in terms of their size, appearance and behavior. Wolves are the largest of the three animals, with males weighing up to 80 pounds and females weighing up to 70 pounds. They have a large, powerful build with a thick coat of fur that is typically grey, but can also be brown or black. Wolves are social animals that live in packs and are known for their howling. Foxes are smaller than wolves, with males weighing up to 15 pounds and females weighing up to 10 pounds. They have a slender, agile build, with a coat of fur that can be red, orange, silver, white or a combination of these colors. Foxes are solitary animals that are known for their cunning and intelligence. Jackals are intermediate in size, with males weighing up to 25 pounds and females weighing up to 20 pounds. They have a thin, scrawny build with a coat of fur that is usually golden or reddish brown. Jackals are social animals that live in small groups and are known for their high-pitched barking calls. In summary, 
the main differences between wolf, fox and jackal are their size, appearance and behavior. Tortoise and Turtle Tortoises and turtles are similar in that they are both reptiles and both belong to the order Testudinus, which includes all turtles and tortoises. One major difference is that tortoises are terrestrial animals, meaning they live on land, while turtles are aquatic animals, meaning they live in the water. This is reflected in their physical characteristics, as tortoises have thick, heavy shells and short, sturdy legs that are well suited for walking on land, while turtles have thin, streamlined shells and webbed feet that are adapted for swimming. Finally, tortoises are generally larger and have a longer lifespan than turtles. Some species of tortoise can live for more than 100 years, while most species of turtle have a lifespan of 20 to 50 years. Dolphin and Porpoise Dolphins and porpoises are both cetaceans, which means they are marine mammals that belong to the family as whales. They are similar in many ways, but there are also some important differences between the two. One of the main differences between dolphins and porpoises is their appearance. Dolphins have a distinct beak or snout, at the front of their head, which is longer and more defined than the shorter, rounder snout of a porpoise. In terms of behavior, dolphins are generally more social and vocal than porpoises. They are known for their playful nature and are often seen jumping out of the water or riding the bow waves of boats. Porpoises, on the other hand, tend to be more solitary and less vocal. Bee and Wasp Bees and wasps are both insects that belong to the order Hymenoptera, but they are different species and have several physical and behavioral differences. Bees are generally larger and rounder than wasps. Bees have hairs on their bodies, which they use to collect pollen and nectar. Wasps have a smooth, shiny exoskeleton. Bees have shorter antennae than wasps. Bees are vegetarians and feed on nectar and pollen from flowers. Wasps are carnivorous and feed on insects and other small animals, as well as nectar and sweet substances. Bees are important pollinators and play a vital role in the reproduction of many plant species. Wasps do not pollinate flowers. Thank you for watching this video on Kidopedia. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more educational videos about animals.